This is SHOT Show TV. I'm Rachel Kopchak, and I'm coming to you live from the beautiful Sands Expo in our amazing TV studio that we have here. And I'm joined now by one of the best in the pro shooting world, <laughs> Julie Golub. And welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. Yes. Let me read off your titles here. <laughs> so you're the first shooter, male or female, to win a national title in all six USPSA divisions and the first woman to earn a triple crown. It's pretty impressive. What does that mean to you? You know, I've been doing this for so many years. This is my 25th year of competing. Wow. So it, you know, it's funny. The titles are obviously a great motivator, mm -hmm. but what I love about the shooting sports are the people, and that's why I've stayed in it for so long. So yes, it's great to win, but I love sharing the sport with everyone. So it's, it's fantastic. Yeah. Now, what's it like uh, being a woman competing against men too? Because that's, you know, you don't always see that in other pro sports. Absolutely. There's like this this split, you know, you have your female golfers and your, you know, male golfers and everything is else. But what, what's great about shooting is we're all in the range together and we all compete at the same level. It's all heads up. Yes, they recognize top female competitors, top senior competitors. Mm -hmm. There's a division and a category for everyone, but it's neat that we're all in the same level playing field. And I'll tell you what, it's pretty fun beating the guys every now and again. <laughs> uh, of course it is, you know. It's nice to give them a run for their money, you know. It's good to surprise them. It is. <laughs> So tell me a little bit about how you got involved in the pro shooting world. Sure. Uh, I started shooting with my dad. I'm a daddy's girl. So I grew up in upstate New York shooting with him. And uh, I was recruited to shoot for the U.S. Army shooting team right out of high school. So that kind of began everything. And I learned so much in the Army shooting for them. And then when it was time for me to move on, that's when I made the full transition to being a pro shooter. And, I haven't looked back. It's been fantastic. <laughs> Best job in the world. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like a lot of fun. Yes. And you've had a lot of experience and you've written a book. So, and there's a lot of great advice in there. Uh, tell us a little bit about the book and some of the advice you share. Sure. The uh, book is called Shoot Your Guide to Shooting and Competition. And uh, I'll tell you, the number one question I get asked is how do I get started in the shooting sports? Because there are so many of them and there are so many different little nuances. If you really love precision sports, then you're going to gravitate here. If you love busting clays with a shotgun, or if you like to shoot fast like I do, there's something for everyone. But it was so hard to put all of that information in emails <laughs> yeah. and Facebook updates that I thought, you know what, this would be really cool to have a book. So Shoot is a primer on how to get started in the shooting sports. It gives you a lot of the basic information on how to be prepared for your first competition, how to work on those fundamental skills that make you feel comfortable and confident, mm -hmm. and of course, have a lot of fun. So how should you decide, you know, which which side of the professional sports world you want to get into? Well, I haven't met a shooting sport I didn't enjoy, so that's a tough <laughs> question for me. <laughs> but I think it comes down to what what what's in your area as, okay. an, as a good place to start. And then after that, just branch out. It, it's amazing what you can learn. Uh, you know, like I said, I, I've shot everything from rifles to pistols to shotguns, and, mm -hmm. and I love all of it. Yeah. So what do you do in your downtime? Go out to the range? <laughs> the range is my office. Right. Um, but during the off season, I love to hunt. Um, and I have two little girls at home, so they keep me very busy, a seven and a two year old. So yeah. uh, I love to cook, I love photography, I love being outside, so do you, it's fun. Do you think they'll follow in your footsteps? Oh, I hope so, I yeah. hope so. But uh, like my dad, he never forced me into the shooting world. It's just something I wanted to share with him. So that's that's what our goal is at home. We want that to be there for them, and they, they can have it if they want to. But if they don't, it's okay. It'll hurt mom's heart a little bit, but it's okay. <laughs> right. Everybody wants their kids to just be successful yeah, and absolutely. have a great future. So real quick, what have, what have you been doing here at SHOT Show 2016? Oh my gosh, it's been a crazy busy show. There's tons. I've been dodging people to get to booth appearances, but I've done a lot of live demos and uh, uh, autograph sessions and showing off new products at various different booths for uh, Smith & Wesson, Benelli, Safari Land, and Federal Premium. And it's just been it's been so much fun connecting with all of the great dealers, the media, the, mm -hmm. the grassroots. Every, it's, it's fantastic. It's great. All yeah. right. Well, best of luck this season, Thank Julie. You. It's Thank been you. great speaking with you, you here on SHOT Show TV.